All right, kiddos, what is up? Oh, fuck, I didn't switch servers. <laughs> there. There's a Discord room. Sorry about that. Okay. Hopefully. Come on, game. Watch. Game? There we go. There we go. I don't know if we're live yet. Well, what's up, guys? How you guys doing? We Welcome to the Wednesday off. Stroke Fest edition of this stream. We need like 17 more kills with the 1895 infantry variant. Then we can switch to another shitty sniper rifle. Well, I hope you guys have had a great week so far. Um, fuck. Apparently, Columbia University has its own Discord. Nice. All right, let's get some tunes going. How about that? There we go. I, I, I. All right. Oh, fuck. What class do I spawn with? Okay, that was awkward. That was awkward. <sighs> yeah, guys, how you doing? What's up? Nooch. That chat, I know. It's like new games, same players, same attitudes. It's kind of silly, right? Well, not silly, but funny, I guess. Or can we spawn? I would really like if I could respond here. Fuck. That's her. Why would you run away, asshole? Fuck. Okay. Hold on. First game. Fuck me. Tell me what's up, man. That's a lot of fucking dudes. Holy shit. Okay. Alright. This obviously isn't the best gun for in your face, but come on, dude, you're eight meters away. Get the yacht yet? No. Stink bug? Maybe. No. What the fuck, teammate? Come on, teammates, 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 please help me. Oh man, teammates, why? <laughs> Why do you guys? Why do you teammates do these things? I. All right, right this is gonna be a strike fest since it's Wednesday, boys. Not gonna lie. It's usually my, it's usually my worst day, since uh, I have something called a career and shit. So yeah, it kind of happens. Huh? But yeah, we are very close to. Oh, unlucky, no! Okay. We are very close to, um, what am I saying? Finishing up all the sniper rifles. All the awful sniper rifles are left. You guys dox that? Rip the dox off the United Flight? Uh, that dude, that dude was a piece of shit. He deserved everything. Like, dude lost his license for 12 years for trying to trade, um, sex with a male patient for, um, prescriptions. He said he wouldn't give him a prescription if he didn't have sex with him. That's fucking gross. And of course, he, um, was selling prescriptions too, so illegal, obviously. Fuck. Nobody show him over top. Damn it. Yeah, the guy that got pulled off the plane, he wasn't going to see patients. He lost his license in 2003 or some shit. Thank God, back in 2015, but a highly limited license. He's only allowed to practice one day a week under supervision of another doctor. Since he's 69, you know he's not actually practicing or anything anymore. Now, the guy's a piece of shit. The guy's a grade-A piece of shit. 
And uh, first of all, um, a lot of people don't understand this, but that those weren't United flight attendants, and that wasn't even a United Airlines plane. It's just a code share with the United Express. And what that generally means is that um, it's a subcontracted out plane, so it's actually an airline called Republic Airlines. On top of that, too, they had full authority to remove him from that flight. Oh, well, he got a fucking boo-boo because he decided to physically resist officers that were trying to remove him. Yeah. It's like, think about fucking drunks at bars and shit. Oh, my God. Yeah, he, uh, he deserved to be, uh, pulled out of that. But anyway, the only thing that, um, they might have messed up on is after he hit his head on the armrest, when he was physically resisting, uh, they probably shouldn't have dragged him across the ground. They should have, uh, probably left him there and gotten him medical attention first. That's the only thing I could see that they probably did wrong there. That's it. Straight up it. Other than that, no. Yeah, that's not good. Why would you give up that so fatty? That was not the right range for this gun. Kobe. I'm ground level too. Uh, I shouldn't be the first one to jump up here, man. I'm not an assault like you, guy. We're gonna die that bomber. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, good, we didn't. I really wish I knew who that last guy was talking to. <laughs> Probably you. One by Artie over here. Over by Fedge. On F. Fuck. You can see two of them have the angle. There's only one. Daily Mail. No, it wasn't the wrong David. No, they're trying to push that narrative that it's a different David. Like, the name that they said it was? That's a 30-year-old dude. Okay, a 30-year-old guy did not have a medical license in 2003. That wasn't the wrong one. Maybe the Daily Mail published the wrong name? Oh, the wrong David at the start. But, um, no, um, everyone else has it right. Fuck, right, I'm gonna get down off this. Just shotgun down by my boy. The fuck? Oh, there's 999 on the other team. Yo, Coblins, what's up, man? Yeah. Oh, the funny, th the funny thing about um, the United Airlines thing is that so many people who don't actually fly are claiming, "Oh, yeah, I'm not going to, I'm not going to take United ever again." It's like you fly like once every two years, motherfucker. So it's like, yeah, okay, your business means jack shit. Plus, you're probably on a hundred dollar fare. BG, Equilibrius, what's up, we know what's up. Uh, yeah, it's kind of hard to cost the company money if you never fucking fly. Uh, might be a strug night. Actually, it will be because it's Wednesday. Always my strug night. I do something called work and career, obviously. Yeah, there is a fucking boat over there, guy. Fuck it, fine, I'm going in. I'm going in since this guy won't. Oh my god, help. Oh, good, nope, nope, he didn't get him. I thought he did. Fuck. Alright, we'll just go all the way around then. Coffee, to the hospital soon. Sucks, man, for what? 
hopefully a uh, regular old checkup. Stock market drop, what? It dropped one fucking percent, and that was actually because of their earnings report that was published for last quarter. If you think it will go down because of that, guess what? It's just going to bounce back up because people will see that's undervalued stock. That's how things work. That's, that's why I have to laugh whenever people that don't know what they're talking about try to get self-righteous. Where's this mortar? I don't know where this mortar is. Uh, not a good spot for me to stand. Alright, gun flag. Fuck me. Ew! God damn it. 1903 experimental left. Yeah, I have that. Um, I have the Russian 1895 trench. The only good guns I have left are the um, Lawrence of Arabia and the um, Martini Henry. Well, the Martini Henry isn't that great either, but. Your foot with an X? Damn, dude! If you lose a toe or something? That would suck. The stock market drop, okay. You see, it's back up. I think it's down 0.2% from Friday. Yeah. This probably wasn't the best res right there. I can't climb this? Shit. Oh, damn, dude. Yeah, that sucks. The spawn point for this is right there, unfortunately. Probably gonna get shot on the side, running up here. God damn it. Oh, he's cavalry too. I'm just getting unlucky. <laughs> How'd they not kill them yet? Oh my god, team. Awful. I guess I was on the flare too. This tank hunter. by bipods. Got tendon big toe. Ooh, that sucks, man. Yeah. Gotta get those steel toe boots. That's gonna be a strike for a little bit. This probably isn't the best weapon for this map either. But we're still sticking with it. Call and fetch here. Like, I really should be fighting in the urban areas with this. Dead soon. Might be dead already. Fuck. Two on the Delta spawn. Oh man. Yeah, dude, so, anything cool and exciting happen to you guys this week? What the fuck are we getting shot by? Oh, heavy tank, okay. Yep. <laughs> oh, okay. Yang Yang, um, all that shit with uh, Kim Jong Un. The thing is, they are heavily reliant on the Chinese because that's their only real ally. So if China drops sanctions on them or uh, stifles trade, they're fucked. They want. What are they going to do? Attack China? Okay. What's that going to last? Two hours? We'd have no problem nuking the fuck out of them. And I'm sure nobody in the Western, nobody in the Western world, will give a shit if China does that. Through the smoke. Fuck. It's like in the spawn. 
Magic. I live. Under by an UC race. God damn it. I'm just getting unlucky really hard. Like, every sniper seems to hit me. Alright, looks like he's dead. Oh shit. Um, nope, on the hill above me. Uh, this might be a flare right here in a second. Are you dead? Get up there. Got to have a good throw. Well, maybe not. Fuck. That sucks. Oh. Heavy tank. Probably going to see an increase in its usage because of Ravik's video. Zero, what's up? Orange, what's up? Radar going? Nice. It's not the way to go. I don't have my AT nade back. Well, just started the stream for the night. Uh, rare detector on ham. Cool. I really can't climb this way. Delta spawn. Two. Oh, this is the wrong guy. I thought that would have been music. That sucks. Kill him. Not the best gun for a uh, 1v2 scenario. Oh, we got him over here. No, that's uh, that's not good. Mortar over here, okay. Where did Mortar go? That's dead. You are giving free college education. Uh, it's kind of stupid, but um, the only proposal that I might actually um support would be something that gives free education, like trade schools or shit like that. Vocational schools, that's about it. Right, what's the point of giving free education for a history degree? On exactly the best use of your resources. Oh, my aim is so shaky tonight, though. World War Three happened already. You probably don't want that, honestly. Because World War Three happens, that means that we're up against a foe that has the same military might as us. That'd be really fucking bad. But you don't want that. Oh my god, that is so many. Yep. Oh my god, how'd I miss all of that? Wow. Oh. Filipino tribal studies? What? God damn it. Just get knifed by that too. That sucks. Yeah. Yeah, no, I'll probably, probably be in much better form within an hour or so. Watch Charlie. At least this RSC, the RSC guns are fun to shoot. So, can't really be that upset with it. I'm gonna use this now for 1895 infantry again. Damn it. 
Stop stealing my kills, nerds. Nowhere to hide from nukes, I know. Our ballistic missile shield is nowhere near ready either. Think about it this way, right? We've tried, uh, we've uh, tried eight intercept launches where we knew how many warheads there were, um, where the uh, ICBM was taking off from, and we knew its full flight path, and we still couldn't even shoot them down till recently. But that's that's obviously not real valid test. That's more of a proof proof of concept test, I'd say. Fuck, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna lose that. No chance on that. At least he doesn't even have a service store on that yet, so I guess, okay. Oh, sweet. Thanks, guy. Sent the godhood already, you all. Queen would survive. <laughs> you guys know I don't care about the stats, but I will tell you the past what month using the awful guns, well, the absolutely awful sniper rifles, probably dropping the stats. <laughs> hmm, got above me. Okay. I don't want to cross that if I don't have to. Why would you give up? I'm right here, asshole! It's on the other side of the wall. Oh. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Where was the hit reg on that? Nice! Ugh, that's so awful! <laughs> what the fuck? Didn't even get his discounts as kill on that. Oh man. I... oh man. I don't know, Dice. Stolen. Oh no, I just got the Peter points. Fuck. Bravo. Uh-oh. No, boat. Go away. Go away, bolt. Do not fucking want. Alright, there's assault here. Oh, no, the right distance to be shooting at, guy. Cavalry, bravo. Watch the boat. Shooting Bravo. <laughs> Warhorse, uh, the play I thought was better than the movie. Especially their uh, horse puppet. I thought that was really fucking cool. Battlefront 2 ad? Whatever. It's gonna be the same shit. Just... I guess new stuff, really? You wanna call it new stuff? Yeah, I like to call that the third hand. Throw the nade out like that. Oh fuck, that's not good. He wasn't too far ahead. Yeah, whatever. I thought they would wait until EA play to uh, launch a new trailer. I guess it was like, fuck it, whatever. It's going to be the same mechanics as first game, but apparently they're going to put in a quote-unquote campaign into it, so... Should have a little more value. Oh no, that's coming here. Yep, 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 yep. Just 
Stolen. Stolen. We're fucked though. This boat's firing right now. We're dead. We're all dead. Oh, maybe not. Fuck. That's a lot, guys. Yep. Did I cad me? That'd be kind of cool. I got triple kill without more. That's disgusting. Oh fuck, bad spawn. Not spawned here. Oh, that's a pilot. If you're watching the side guy, uh, it's probably not. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Nope, why would you give up right there, asshole? God, what a dipshit. Oh my god. If I knew he was going to do that, I wouldn't rest him. I would have died, obviously. Coming into that, what if? Bad players are bad. Stuck. American Horror Story. Cool. Yeah, I never got into American Horror Story. New Kong. See the round thing not loading for you? Nope. Which means servers might be down, right? That would imply. Yeah, you know, one of you nerds go check out the forums and find out for us. Probably what's up, man. Last one's up. I wonder if we can open this and see what happens. Oh, well, I already have this gun. There's an easy way to check. I'll just check Battlefield Tracker. Let's see. Uh oh. I think it's down. Uh oh. Looks down. Yo, DNC, what's up, man? I don't know. Battlefield Tracker might be down. Who knows? The easy way to check is for me to go see how many kills... Oh, no. It's still up, I think. Nooch! Yo, yeah, so, Nooch, why aren't you flying around in these uh, World War One bombers, mate? Tank that way, guy. Or Thunder? Ah, no interest in that. So, guys, yeah. Apparently, I do still have Sniper Elite 4. Um, Horizon. Fuck. The get, Charlie. Horizon Zero Dawn. Um, Final Fantasy 15, finish up. For Honor, Wildlands. What the fuck just damaged? What the f 
Yeah, taking damage without there being an animation is getting kind of old. Yeah, taking damage from tanks or explosives without an animation is getting kind of old. the plane. Look at that glitch right there. Uh, how did they not see that? I mean, they were on the mini-map earlier, and this guy just gives up there, too. Uh, I didn't get the kill. I got the PETA points, though. Only bought the game a week ago? Okay, cool. So you're level 8 now. Okay, you've probably seen all you need to see about the game. Oh, that guy's cheating. I think that guy's cheating. That guy's probably cheating. You fucking idiots. Come back. Oh my god, what was the suppression on that? What the fuck? Was I suppressed? What? What? I don't know. I don't even want to know. I like the bolt actions? Yeah, well, the bolt actions are really fucking easy in this game. Because, um, broke. Nice aim. No, that support there that I killed, yeah, that dude was flat out. <laughs> That's where that damage was coming from. <laughs> oh, man. This is not the range to be using this gun. Three shot this range. One guy coming up behind you is well behind Hurricane. I thought you were in the RD truck. Oh fuck me. That's why you like COD 5. World at War was pretty cool. Oh, I'm gonna get out of here. Oh, that guy on a sweet spot, man, that's awful. Okay. Oh, that thing bounce, mate. I'm not really a fan of a lot of the uh, a lot of sniper rifles in this game, but some of them are fun to use. All easy to use if that's what you're into, though. God damn it. Oh, I actually picked that side. Poor Thunder. Oh, I don't like free to play games. Too many poor people in them. You know what I'm saying. Can't really deal with poor people. Because they expect the world when they're not even paying anything for the game. Rare skins? Do they have rare skins in that shit? Oh, might have to check that out then. That's the case. Not the flag for me to be on with this gun. What? Is a hundred dollars in that wall? really want to res this. Oh, you gave up anyway, because you're an asshole. Oh, that didn't go in. Where is he? Where'd he go? Did he die? I guess he did. Okay. Free to play. Skins are gross. I oh, don't know. Skins are awesome. They let you uh, show your superiority versus shitters. Come on, give me some more nades, please.
No health bars. One War Thunder. Interesting. Alright. Feel like I are there. Full server. Fuck. I'm dead. Yep, we're dead. Yep. That nade. Magnus, what's up, man? Just grinding out the final kills needed on this gun. Not that bad. Much better guns, though. Rather be using the Mondragon. Coming up top, shotgun. You're up top. Okay. Charlie Murphy. Oh. Uh, that from? No, it's not. He's dead. Already truck Bravo. Is that a mortar variant? Not sure yet. I haven't seen a yes, fire. Yes, it is. That's a mortar variant. Oh, even better then. Uh, actually, wait. Just probably get off that. Probably get snipped. Oh, we're just gonna go, Charlie. Oh, man. That's a medic. Yeah, I'm not gonna kill him. <laughs> gonna take three shots out of this range to kill him. Yeah. And I was behind that corner, but that's okay, dice. <laughs> Definitely around that corner. Appreciate you, game. 1.6 KD. What is that? I'm so confused. I mean, you nerds. Well, that's not good. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, that's one way to handle it. Okay, heavy tank. Definitely one way to handle it. Let's see if we just go flank these guys then. Mm, I don't know. We'll see top of the stairs. Ah. Come on, give me the give me the revolver kill. God damn it! I didn't even get the revolver kill out of that. Oh, disappointing dice. I get sweet spotted. Oh, so disappointing. It's gonna be one of these nights. I can tell. I didn't even get the sis counts as kill on that. So bad. Not pleased with you. Destroy three vehicles with K bullets. It's actually pretty difficult to do. I really don't want to come over here. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. It's clear guy. 
24 hour. What? Get good. Yeah, no, I need to. Ugh. It really is late. It's about 110 here. Not too late. Relatively late for most people, though. So. Are we taking your Charlie? Now he's going Delta. Flag right there. Oh. First aid, use it. Okay, I got fucked. It's the first aid, pal. There, first aid for you. I don't think I've killed anything in like five minutes. To start. What? ADS, please? We're dead. Maybe not. LOC was LOC. Always unlucky. Oh man. Oh man. I'm struggling hard right now. Can't even land shots right now. Tight. It is Wednesday. I'm one of the only medics on this team. <sighs> Fedge. Oh, hey, this guy here. Hello. What's up, man? Kids don't care about what. Take the medical pouch. Enemy airship spotted. Good. Alright. Oh, oh, the airship. Oh, skill vehicle. Oh, oh. We're gonna die, RNG fall. Oh, yep, I knew it. I knew it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Holy fuck. I'm not really contributing much right now. I don't even care. My skills pay the bills, what? Well. United Airlines probably do. All that shit's overblown. So what is it down 0.3% since um last Friday? We're dead. They're not. Alright, guy bailed behind me.
Okay. The gunner. Oh, guns for you, nerds. Oh, just for the engine. Actually, I should destroy that right there. Oh, is that Ubi stock? Ubi's uh, stock? Nice, whatever. The guy teabagged is probably going to come back, though. I'm in the HMG on Bravo. Yeah, that's the thing, even if the United stock gets way too low, as long as our financials are good, all those metrics are good, people still fucking buy it. People will just probably buy more at that point in time if it's undervalued. That's how things work. And then, like, all those people are like, oh no, I'm never gonna fly United again. Yeah, they will. Watch when Christmas time rolls around. And it, we're gonna die the bomber. Actually, he might bail on me. Yeah, wait until Christmas time rolls around. And flights on United are $100 cheaper. Or even $50 cheaper. Family of four, that's $200 savings. Yeah, I'm sure you're not going to fly United ever again. Okay. I'm assuming this guy's probably gonna bail right on top of me soon. Oh, I didn't get it. Fuck. Damn it. I should be surprised nobody came to knife me there. Vito, what's up, man? I'm actually struggling hard right now. It is Wednesday, though. My aim is usually jumpy on Wednesdays. But this gun, it's still fun to fire. The uh, This is RSC Factory variant, I believe. Yeah, exactly. And the thing is, too, I don't think we would actually have an issue if, um, once he hit his head and he decided to go limp in the uh, aisle there, if they just called paramedics before they escorted him off. Like, that's the only mistake I saw there. The airline was well within their rights to remove him from that flight. And on top of that, too, the cops, um, when the cops show up, even if they are quote-unquote wrong, if they tell you you're under arrest or they're removing you or detaining you, you still have to do, uh, follow their directions. Lawful order like that. Right. So, pretty much he's resisting arrest right there, so, um, I like to equate it to, uh, people at a bar. Like, you're gonna pay your cover charge to get into the bar, right? But just because you paid the cover charge doesn't mean you can stay there and be an asshole. Clean shirt going far left. You won't. I can fix it. Bomber, hold on. First thing, use it. And uh, think about it this way. If the bouncers tell you, well, the bartender's probably gonna tell you to leave first. Then they'll call security. Now, security may or may not grab you and physically remove you themselves. Or if they do, generally they're going to call the cop over that's at the front door of their bar. Or the cop that's on site. And what do you think is going to happen? You're going to get dragged the fuck out of there. Now, if you happen to, I don't know, fall down and scrape your face on the ground or something while you're being dragged out of there. Because you refuse to go under your own free will. And yeah, shit's going to happen, but no. They're not liable for those injuries you suffered. So, that's pretty much the equivalent right there. Oh my god, I cannot fucking aim right now. Fuck me. I'm struggling right now. United's incompetence? Uh, no. First of all, you're being a fucking idiot, and here's why, okay? 
First of all, there was no United Airlines plane or flight attendants or gate agents or anything like that involved. Okay. You gotta understand that it was, first of all, a United Express flight, which means it's a code share with a regional airline, a small regional airline called Republic Airlines. So no, there are no United pilots involved, no United flight attendants, no United gate, atten gate agents or anything like that. Not even a United plane. So, yeah. So it's a code share agreement like that, so it's pretty much them subcontracting out a small flight from Chicago to Louisville. Like, who the fuck actually flies that, right? Yeah, no. Like, everyone's like, oh no, you should've just upped the offer. That's a 300 mile fucking flight, so was that, a four and a half hour drive? They already offered up to 800, or a thousand, depending on who you want to listen to. Let's even say it was 800, okay? Because that's what the passengers all heard. But uh, it's possible they did offer up to a thousand, and passengers who were interviewed didn't hear that part. So let's say it's 800, okay? When you buy an airline ticket, you're not actually guaranteed a specific seat on a specific airplane. According to their contract of carriage, which is what you actually agree to when you buy the airline ticket, you know all those terms and services you have to check the box and say, yes, I agree to the terms. When you buy an airline ticket on even Orbits or Expedia, or obviously directly from the airline themselves. That's all there in the fine print, okay? So, with that said, even if you buy like an aisle seat and pay the extra money for it and you're relocated to a middle seat, too fucking bad. The only thing you're actually entitled to do in that situation is your seat fee, your seat reservation fee. So what, your $15 or whatever? And, uh, that's there in place because think about it this way. Let's say, um... A mother with a two-year-old child purchases last two seats on the airplane. Then everyone already picked their seats, and the only seats left are middle seats that are about ten rows away from each other. The flight attendant is going to move some motherfucker if nobody wants to volunteer to swap with either the mother or the child. That's, that's what happens there. I'm sorry, that's really what happens. <laughs> Almost fucked that guy up. So, with that said, you can't just keep up upping the offer for um, somebody to bump to the next flight. It just doesn't work that way. Um, pretty much there are two things involved in that. One's called VDB, the other one's IDB. VDB is Voluntary Denied Boarding. That's um, when they give those offers. So when you get on the plane and they're like, first three people to hit their flight attendant call button, we get a $500 voucher or whatever to take the next flight. That's the VDB situation. Now, if you don't have enough volunteers, after that, the uh, Department of Transportation says you can do something called IDB, which is Involuntary Denied Boarding. Now, generally, an airline doesn't want to do that because it costs a lot of money, but, um... Yeah, it's not loading for me either. But, the thing is that, um... The penalty for uh, Involuntary Denied Boarding is... First of all, if it's... If your uh, replacement flight is four hours later, it's 400% of the cost of your one-way fare in cash up to $1,350. So let's say you have a $300 one-way fare, they IDB you, they have to give you $1,200 cash on the spot, plus you're still flying on your next flight out. Or let's say you're like, fuck it, I don't want to do this, just give me my $1,200 and refund my $300 fare, that'll happen too. They'll get $1,500 and probably use $500 of that and book it on some, walk up to the counter on the airline next door, buy that one-way flight right away. But here's the thing, right? So this stupid motherfucker, on this 300 mile flight, he probably had an $80 ticket. So United Airlines was actually Republic Airlines because Republic was the one that's actually flying the plane, and it's their plane. They said, look, we don't have to go more than $800, which is more generous because most of you are on sub $100 fares. So what does that mean? $75 fare, let's say his ticket was $75, 400% of that is $300. So they already offered up to $800 for people to voluntarily take the next flight, and nobody wanted to do that. Well, not enough people want to do that. So why would they even up it to 1000 or even 2000 There's no point when in their contract it says as long as they're willing to pay you 400% of the ticket price, they can involuntarily bump you. That's how it works. That's how it fucking works. So think about it. It's on a $75 fare. They just have to give them $300 cash and say, okay, oh well. But here's the other thing about IDB. If it's with, if your replacement flight is within an hour, they owe you zero. So pretty much how it goes though, for the IDB ranking list, first of all, if you have elite status, that 
disqualifies you from being picked to be involuntarily bumped. After that, it's going to be fair class. So if you're in business class first cla or first class, you're probably not going to get bumped because that's going to be really fucking expensive for them to do it. So then you go down to the coach tickets and shit like that. Well, first what they'll do is, um, before the people who actually paid money for their, uh, that flight, they'll find the people who used miles for the flight because that's actually a free flight for them, so they won't really owe you much. After that, they'll go to the people who paid for the $50 fare, that super last minute 3 a.m. fare that randomly popped up. And so the doctor was selected. Okay, so since he threw a fu well, actually four people were selected. The other three people, they just gathered their belongings and got off the fucking plane like the hundreds of people do it each day that get IDB'd. But no, this motherfucking quote-unquote doctor who actually ended up being a pervert and a drug dealer decided no. I think I'm too good to get off this fucking plane. I'm going to make up an excuse that I have patience in the morning, which he obviously didn't. And that's another subject we'll get into as well. But um, so United or actually Republic Airlines asked him to get out of the seat multiple times. Colton Connolly, probably over 15, 20 minute thing, because you have to understand the police aren't actually always right there by the front, by the gate. They're not by the gateway ready to come on the plane at a moment's notice. Like, they have to actually put in a call to a supervisor to pull somebody from, to, well, actually, to uh, put in a call to the PD, police department, and um, send somebody over that gate. So that'll take at least 15 minutes from the point you make that call. So the whole time they're probably talking to him, that sort of stuff. And uh, according to um, uh, witness testimony, first the flight attendants told him he had to leave. Then the gate agent came on and told him the same thing, too. This is probably 15 minutes, then the cops show up. Cops probably talked to him for about 5 to 10 minutes, and then he said, I'll get off for $1,600. Obviously, based on what I told you guys earlier about VDB and max compensation that they're legally required to provide, they're going to laugh at that, so... I guess, whatever. They want to laugh at him and say, ha, no fucking way. They're right to do so, and I don't blame them. So, at that point in time, the airline tells the police, hey, well, um... He can't be here. Think about it this way. It's just like if a bar kicks you out or something like that. Or they decide, hey, we're not, we're just going to cancel your ticket. I'm not flying you at all. Either because you stink or something, or you're not wearing a shirt, which they're able to do. If you smell bad enough, they can actually throw you off the plane. It's, that is specifically listed in the contract you enter into. Three under Charlie Dell's bridge. So, pretty much, um, at that point in time, the cops say, hey, you need, you need to get out of here. You're being trespassed. Because what is it called if you linger in an area where the property owner tells you that they don't want you to be in anymore? That's called trespassing. What happens if you refuse to leave? Cops will show up. And then what happens after that if you don't listen to them? They will drag you the fuck out of there and put handcuffs on you. So the motherfucker in the video decides, hey, I'm going to try physically holding on to my seat. I'm not going to get out of the seat at all. Fuck me. Fuck. Okay. I'm not going to get out of the fucking seat, even though they're grabbing and pulling on me to get out of there. Which is what's going to happen. It's going to happen, right? I'm thinking about it this way. There's a guy in your front lawn, and the police show up, and you're like, hey, I don't want him here. He's trespassing. What do you want them to do? Sit there and ask him night ask the trespasser for an hour to leave? No. Eventually, they're going to grab him and drag him off your property, throw him in the back of a squad car, and bring him... And bring him to the fucking police department, right? Well, that's why I'd hope would happen. And thankfully, it does happen. Oh my god. Yeah, that's what does happen. So, um, so why is it any different on an airplane? It's not. So, pretty much, people freak the fuck out. Because the initial headline read, United Airlines drags a doctor off a plane that said he didn't want to be bumped because he had patients to see in the morning. Now, you know that's not true now. On top of that, it doesn't matter what his occupation is, and here's why. Because do you really want an airline playing the game of, hey, we need to determine who deserves to be on this flight more? Like, think about a single mother trying to fly home because her babysitter is finally leaving or whatever. Or somebody trying to make it home for a court date or a college student trying to make it back to school for a final or something like that. Or I don't know, somebody who's trying to go to a funeral, right? Do you really want airlines listening to all these stories and determining who should be on that plane? Or who should be bumped? 
I don't. So the best way to not fall into that trap is to just do it by predefined rules, which I outlined earlier, how they decide who they're going to kick off. That's by... by fuck me. That's by um, how much you fucking paid to be on that flight. Right? And obviously, if you're buying a last-minute ticket because family member died and you're trying to fly somewhere, your ticket prices are going to be really high, so you're probably not going to be bumped in that situation. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. So anyway, um, a lot of people freak the fuck out because, oh my god, I cl he claimed he was a doctor. Oh my god, blood on his lip. Oh my god. Oh my god, why are you dragging him? Oh my god. He deserves to be on this plane, even though contractually he doesn't. He's actually trespassing because he didn't want to fucking leave. That's really it. But no, people are dumb. You guys know this. They freak out about everything. This injury was his own damn fault. Think about when the cops showed up. Even when they were dragging him out of the seat, if he did not try to hold on to that seat, like physically resist being removed from the seat, he wouldn't have fl been flung across the aisle when he lost his grip and hit his face on the armrest. So no, it's his own fucking fault. Yeah, so everyone everyone right now wants to pretend, oh, we're gonna boycott United Airlines, okay. Fucking do that, that means less, more seats on the plane, which means cheaper fares. So then what's gonna happen around Christmas time, when their flights are $50 cheaper? Family of five, they'll save $250 by flying United, and all their outrage will be gone. Even if they still hate United, they're still gonna say, oh well, that $250, that's like our hotels for two nights at Disney. But yeah. It's all a bunch of fake, bullshit, whiny, self-righteous, fake outrage. And there you go. My lawyer? Did I go to law school? Yes. Do I practice law? No. I have an MBA and a JD, though, if that's what you're asking. And plus, at the same time, too, you don't need to be a lawyer to actually understand contracts and shit. It's plainly written, which is why it's actually awesome that a guy like that, uh, Gorsuch, fuck me, god damn it, a guy like Gorsuch is on the Supreme Court, because, uh, his, his legal opinions, when he writes them out, he writes them out so the common man can understand them, he doesn't have too much legalese in his, um, in his rulings. Just use private plan exactly. That's kind of what I do now, but hey. Yeah, so a lot of fake outrage. Just remember that, guys. Everyone wants to be upset about something. Now, what's really funny, though, is, like, if you go on social media and shit, even if you show them the video of, um, him flying across the aisle because he's obviously resisting being removed from the seat, People will still try to equate that to him being quote unquote beaten. And then if you ask them, yo, is there any clip or um, any sort of uh, eyewitness testimony of him being punched, kicked, or anything like that, they're just going to say, oh my god, you're fucking blind. Some shit like that. Because people just want to be outraged. That's it. Like I said, they will forget about that shit once United has the cheapest flights. That's what always happens. Backside. Ugh, of course I get killed by the uh, He didn't need to be BFB. The only actually looking back on it, the only thing they probably should have done differently was when he hit his head on the armrest, which I don't think the police were aware of immediately, was once he slumped to the ground in the aisle, they should have actually left him in place there and called paramedics. Make sure he's not injured. And that's why I think um you guys might have uh, noticed that one of the officers was placed on paid leave. And I'm pretty sure it was the plain clothes officer that actually dragged him. Like the other two, they weren't they weren't actually dragging him. But so yeah, once he hit his head or something like that, they probably should have just left him in the aisle and call the paramedics, make sure he wasn't injured or anything like that. Well severely injured. You guys know what I'm saying? Sweet. Orf. But yeah, lots of fucking fake outrage. Yeah, he didn't- he didn't have to apologize. Oh my god, I cannot fucking aim tonight. How did you have an angle? How did you have an angle? 
Oh, I know why. Because dice. Oh, I was four feet past that wall, dice. Come on. Wasn't Air Marshal also involved? No, there's no Air Marshal on that flight. Which brings me to another point, though. People want to try to be like, well, he boarded the plane, so not involuntary denied boarding anymore because he's already on the plane. So then I just ask them this sort of shit, right? Well, first of all, um, even... Until the door is closed and everyone is seated, boarding actually hasn't finished, so they're still boarding, so... Really, he didn't board. And just like I told you guys earlier, that, um... You are not entitled to the seat that you actually book. Um, like, uh, flight attendants can move you around for any reason, even if you paid extra to have a window seat. Only thing you're entitled to is a refund on that on that seat charge, or whatever. So, um, think about it this way. You fucking board the flight, you step through the door, you get to your seat, and some dude has the exact same seat assignment as you. One of you has to get off the plane, right? Or what if you get to your seat and you figure out the seat's broken? You can't fly in a broken seat. It just uh, they just won't let you. It's an F FAA violation. Do so. Or... What if an air marshal last minute decides to jump on your plane, which happens a lot, especially if you're flying out of New York. Sorry, it happens. And the air marshal will generally pick the first class seat that's closest to the cockpit. For obvious reasons, right? Because of a threat saying towards the cockpit. Probably be good if he's right by the cockpit, right? So yes, I've seen people even with first class tickets get bumped. Well, generally what happens in that case is if it's a full flight, first class is full, and an air marshal comes on, they will sit there and they will ask the guy who had a first class ticket, well, um, should we give you uh, some money and you take the next flight out in an hour? Obviously, he's still in first class, or what we can do is we can put you in coach, refund you, refund you your first class fee, your first class ticket, and give you a voucher or whatever. So what do you think happens? They bump a coach passenger out for the guy who was riding in first instead. That's just what happens. I'm sorry. So those are three situations where you could be on the fucking plane already, or even sitting down in your seat, and you don't get to fly on that flight. So yeah, a lot of people just complain about the shit, don't fly. Or the ones who want to claim they're never going to fly United again, don't fly to begin with. So... I'm coming. Assuming that's you. No, no, it wasn't. Never flown anything except Southwest. Yeah. Well, and those procedures will happen on any airline. In the United States, you have protection, though. Like, if you have a flight that originates out of Asia or something, I don't think there are VDB or IDB compensation guidelines. So they can just bump you for free. So, I don't know what people want. Uh, the other thing is too, um, this happens because, um, a lot because airlines overbook, but the funny thing is that JetBlue doesn't do any overbooking, but stats show last year they had the most IDBs by far. So, yeah. The thing is, if you don't overbook, then, um, you have to pass that, that extra cost on to other tickets, so... Most people, if you ask them, hey, would you rather have a small chance of, uh, which actually means one out of, I think, what, 50,000 passengers of being involuntarily bumped, or have to pay 5% more on every single ticket you buy, most people will want to save money. That's just how it works. There's a lot of people just crying about shit all the time. Yeah, so, really funny to me. People just love to be outraged. That's okay. VDB tells you to get off. VDB is voluntary denied boarding, so that's you agreeing. That's that's like when the flight attendant is like, yo, first three people press their call button, get $500, get rebooked on next flight out, that sort of stuff, right? And you know people jump on, on that all the time because, I mean, it's free money, right? Especially if you're only being delayed like two hours or something. Or if you're a college kid, that's a lot of fucking money. But, um, after VDB comes IDB, where not enough people volunteered to get out. That's stupid. That's stupid. So stupid. Ugh.
Yeah. Oh yeah, Russian. Yeah, they'll they'll bring guns to force you the fuck off. They'll probably beat you in Russia if you don't get off the fucking plane. I don't know. A lot of people just want to cry about stuff, or they're commenting because they don't understand what the fuck happened. Now, um, another common one is this question was brought up because in the video you can hear a passenger say something along the lines of. Well, why don't they just, uh, get a bus or, uh, drive the pilots to, uh, Louisville? Alright, see, that doesn't fucking work, and here's why. Because, with, uh, pilots and airline attendants, uh, first of all, the FAA has minimum rest guidelines for them, and they have maximum working hours before they're mandated to take a rest. Now, they're considered on clock and actually working, even the moment they step on the shuttle bus to ride from their hotel or whatever to the airport. So, you see the issue. So, yeah. And plus, um, think about it this way. Do you really want to ride on a plane where pilots just rode five hours or something in a bus? Or weren't able to rest enough and they have to fly you? I don't. Man, but I guess some people are just really dumb, though. It's like a bliat. What's this guy? Must be chilling around here, obviously. Oh, here he is. Yeah. Hey, guy. Two on my body. Come on, dice. I'm going for him. I think he's dead. I oh, don't know. I don't want to go that way. Yep, 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 yep. Saw the tank over there. I knew that would not have ended well. Oh, air shotgun. Oh. Full rest of friend pilot. Exactly. Modi, what's up, man? But yeah, if any of you guys. Yeah, would a doctor realistically act that way? Here's another thing, too. I talked to some of my friends who are doctors. Okay, if you had mission critical patients the next morning, what are you doing taking a night flight home the night before? Oh, on top of that, too. All those other passengers, if they really made a big stink over him being a doctor, but she obviously, um, it's not a good doctor. Why didn't they get off the flight for him? For the greater good, then. They want to pull that sort of, uh, that sort of self-righteous bullshit. Oh my god. Oh, fuck me. Unlucky. Unlucky. Unfucking lucky, boys. Why am I so unlucky? I'm gonna get mortared. Let me in! What? Alright, he's upstairs. Yeah, he's right here, guy. Oh, he isn't. Okay. Because he isn't. But, yeah, of course. You get hit by the boat. There are two medics here. Come on. Come on. Come on. That thing's five health. We're dead. Yep. Air shotgun. I have a Mercedes, I have an SLS. It's all headline rating. But yeah, so that's really why I blew up on social media, because of my doctor angle or whatever. But then, uh, once people saw the video now, um, they want to equate it to, Oh my god, United Airlines beats people. Yeah, that wasn't that spawn.
Yeah, people are just fucking dumb. That's it. They don't know what the fuck they're talking about most of the time. Yeah, then you get all these idiots on message boards who are like, oh no, well, uh, well, uh, no, it's not trespassing, and, uh, the cops won't, uh, physically remove somebody, they're going to calmly try to de-escalate and talk to them, it's like, look, motherfuckers, they asked him for about 30 minutes straight to get off the fucking plane, kindly, right, and he still didn't want to do it, so then, um, on this one message board, um, one guy uh, that actually supported the airline was like, Yo, hey, well, what do you think is going to happen if um, you walk, come to your home and uh, you, some stranger is in it? And then you call the cops. Oh, air shotgun. Oh. Skill. Anyway, so then uh, one of the posters was like, Oh no, the cops won't. The cops won't do anything. They're going to show up and say it's a civil matter. And they won't do anything unless there's, like, evidence of a broken door or a broken window. I'm like, no, you fucking idiot. If somebody is in your house and you call the police and you don't want them there, no, they're going to trespass them and they will arrest them and drag them the fuck out. But that's the stupidity of, uh, internet, though. Or people who are so hell-bent on hating on United or something. It happens. But, see, that's the thing, though. I'm willing to bet 99% of the people who are crying about it don't even realize that wasn't even a United Airlines plane. Or staff. Like, if you say Republic Airlines, don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Oh, air shotgun. But yeah, United Airlines staff and metal had nothing to do with this incident. All Republic Airlines. Thought of that too, it wasn't United staff that removed him from his seat, physically, it was Chicago PD. So, what are people upset about again? I don't understand. Except people just want to be upset about shit. It's kind of funny. Unexpected. Oh. Dead random guy. I uh, know, boycott Delta, boycott all this other shit. It's really funny though. <laughs> like I said, let's just wait. Let's even just wait a month. Let's wait a fucking month and see if anybody remembers this shit. Just wait, wasn't it Delta that kicked off a uh, Middle Eastern looking dude that was a professor for writing down mathematical equations in his notebook? And then, what was it, the other week, uh, a cellist was kicked off of a flight. Everybody fucking forgets about this shit. Hi, TD, what's up? Obviously, there are chem weapons. Yeah. Yeah, there are chem weapons. Yeah, random guy in your house, dead random dude. That's how it goes. I don't- I'm getting the feeling these rounds don't count, because, um... Yeah, I think battle logs down or whatever, or it's the server. Oh yeah, definitely down. Yeah. So none of these stats count. Speed. <laughs> Get water.
Difficult what's up. Hmm. Hitler never used chemical weapons. Uh, no, you're talking about uh, Sean Spicer. And he's actually right, Hitler never actually did use chemical weapons. Yes, he used uh, Zyklon B in his gas chambers. But he never actually used chemical shells or anything like that in actual warfare. So, important distinction there. But, I don't know. People are weird, though. Actually, no, we don't want to throw that yet. Alright, so we need 500 kills with this for the Elite Codex, so we'll use this. On this map right now. No, nope, that's not the way. Turn away from him. This guy's ping is through the fucking roof. 300. Okay. Yeah. I knew it. But there's no reg on that guy. If we were to attack North Korea, we're not going to attack North Korea. No point in us attacking them. I don't even think um, China would uh, be very supportive of North Korea if they were to attack anyone else right now either. being bad. There's too many guys there. Think of that overhyped guy named Snowden, what about him? I think he's different from guys like Bradley Manning because he actually exposed a domestic spying program. He didn't uh, reveal troop movements. Fuck, this guy here still? Really? Oh my god. Oh well. Nice. Two piece with the gas nades. Oh, so good. I have not captured a flag this round. That's why my score's so low. Sweet. Bombing Syria was the best thing. Yeah, see, there's a massive difference between actually sending in ground troops and... I, I saw that coming. And just firing cruise missiles into there. Like, you could fire cruise missiles all day. They can't do shit about it. I need to jump on some flags. Yeah. Nope. Not the way. Nope. Ugh. Spotted in there. Rez! Come on, guy! Alright, thank you. Oh, that guy got turned on. Oh, there's a the high pinger again. We're gonna 
gonna get C4. Let's C4 right here. All right, feel it. Oh god. Reg, oh, Shangulong. I wonder what continent he's playing from. Fuck. Michael, what's up, man? Flares. Oh, this is going to be a stellar entertaining round from here on out. Yep. That is not our boba. Watch it. <laughs> oh! I was behind him. And it oh, you did get it. Yes, but I was behind him the first time and it wouldn't give it to me. That's like when you and I double teamed that one guy I want to grab him, remember? We were both stabbing him, we should have gone to sooner. Yeah, these servers are definitely down right now. Well, maybe it's just this one. No, oh, this, no, this isn't going to... This isn't going empty. 65 kill kill streak. It's like a 200 kill streak in this game. Dead, my own nade. Yeah, I saw that. Huh? J Bears, come on! No! No, he's not doing that. Fuck me. That sucks. I don't think you can actually revive from accidents. Oh, that is something gnarly. No, shouldn't stand here. Come on. Mm -hmm. You suck. Turn him. Here's another one. Top side of Alpha. They are a decent amount of high pingers too, so it's tight. I'm not gonna make it back in. Nope, didn't make it in. Not fucking kill him, teammates. God damn it. That's okay. It's one of these nights. 
We're only an hour and a half into this fucking stream. Holy shit. Probably that over the top yeah. there. Why did you know stop the And the grill song? Gorilla sucks, man. <laughs> what the fuck? You guys see that? <laughs> you guys see that? <laughs> Holy shit, game. He saw him flinch and he took no damage. <laughs> flinch and no fucking damage. F is for family now. Going to put me in the phase division if I do say so myself. That was her. Oh fuck. Right, right behind you. Oh shit. <laughs> so many guys right here. Oh no! <laughs> Holy fuck, what is going on in there? Oh, really? God damn it. Oh, man. Oh, dice. I'm gonna push you, shotgun! I think we need to get a shotgun in there. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, that guy's probably pissed. <laughs> that guy's probably pissed. I know I would be. It'd spawn right there. Uh, got one stick of dynamite. Oh yeah, new Mario Kart. Pre-order that shit for the uh, Switch. Should be good. Comes with all the DLC. Well, yeah, not that way. We're dead. Maybe not. Oh, the train mortar. It's not happening. Still don't have any nades. Awful. Kill him? We're gonna get mortared right here. I got this guy over here. He saw his maid fly by. Where are you, guy? Actually, I should probably just go for Delta then. Those might be an enemy flare. I kind of wish you could tell if it's enemy flare or friendly flare. This way. Oh fuck. I don't have any teenagers, that sucks. Oh, his being's high, I think. No. Oh no. Ugh. It's awful. Probably should have killed him. Molotov's a hard line. Yeah, they should, but they don't. A lot of guys there. It's kind of my fault for not killing the medic. Oh, 
On the high rock on the right. We got res. Nice. What? That range? Really? Her guy over here. <laughs> Stolen. Kind of bullshit kill. Fuck. Ugh. Should have killed him too. Should have killed him too. No medics. No. Never had a childhood. What? I get res. Sweet. Oh, what a good teammate. Alright, this isn't a good spot. Alright, I'm gonna push out this way. Why would you do that? Oh, up high and. I get shot in the back right here. Nope. Oh fuck, impact nade. That sucks. I only did 13 damage to him. Really dark setting. Uh, I had the gas mask on, buddy. Fuck, why'd I respawn there? This map's a little bit darker now, too, since um, the DLC came out. Change the lighting on it. Over here. Like, what is damaging me? Feeling Amazon Prime was. Twitch, not sure. Oh fuck you, train. I think I can fault that though. Awesome. Yeah, um, I think the server isn't tracking stats right now. No, it's not the right way to go. That dude's one tapping with that fucking thing. Ugh. That just shows how much pack bursting is going on right now. Awful. Awful dice. Fix your shit. Fix your shit. That's not even applying the damage until one burst of it. It's really annoying. Because you don't know you're getting damaged, obviously. I'd obviously play that situation differently if you knew he was looking at you, shooting at you. Oh, living objective apples. No one gives a shit.
Oh shit. Fuck. Yeah, there's too many guys there. Way too many guys there. Okay, you see that? Tutu's body, zero damage, though. What is going on with this game at times? Oh, he has 111, okay. Makes sense. Makes sense, okay. Okay, okay. Future for VR? Yeah, I see one. Not really for gaming, though. You have to understand, VR, its main purpose won't be for video games and shit. So many idiots think video games like the main goal for any tech that comes out, and it's really not. Oh my god. Ugh. I'm just doing stupid shit. Get unlucky. Aw. He just got ran by a dick. I didn't want anyone thinking I still care, but don't, but you still get my phone, but still get my phone, but still get my phone, but No, it's okay that I didn't rack up a lot of, um... I didn't rack up a lot of, um... Sniper rifle kills. Because... Stat server's down right now. Okay, how are we going to get up here? No! Can't climb that, okay. That sucks. Sucks game. Man ammo. Ouch. This one got deported, nice. Can't eat or drink water in VR. How do you want to do that? Only fatties do that. Only fatties. Yeah. Rivers down. Look at this. When you told me that you hated my friends, the only problem was with you and not that. And every time None of this you told me my opinion was wrong, counts for anything. So it's okay. Where I came from. Kinda sucks because. I really want to rack up kills with the, um, 1895. Yeah. I don't think it's working. Nope. Nope. That's okay. Twenty thousand scrap. Nice. I'm out for two years. <laughs> you won't. Oh, wait, metals. Cables, that's not happening. SMG? How have I not done SMGs yet? Mm. Fuck. Nailed it. <laughs> yeah, that's not happening. Yeah, people lying about JB. Kinda weird. Just 
Looks like people still lying about Justin Timberlake. I'm doing well, man. How are you doing, bud? Yeah, I was having a ball. My chat always has a good time. You guys know this. We allow you guys to talk about whatever the fuck you want. That's why. Buy all your dildos off Amazon. Nice. Nice. And see, here's the other thing, too, DNC. It's like, you're gonna get a lot of these, uh, overly alpha nerds. Little alpha video game nerds. Like, oh my god, yeah, I, I would never listen to that. Oh, Taylor Swift? Oh, no. That dude shot me with his back. <laughs> He's too health. Uh, same room as me. That dude shot me with his back. Alright, he's dead. <laughs> dude shot me with his back. Oh, man, my luck. Oh my god, I can't hit shit right now. That's okay. You know why? None of the shit matters because it's... Done. Actually, someone else is. Shit, got me on. Nope. Yeehaw command, what? I think you guys can make commands. I don't know the syntax for it though. Fuck dude, really? Oh my god, please die? Okay. Yeah, I don't really like this revolver. Thankfully it's almost over with. Fuck. Nope. What's going on right now? Oh, that guy's on the rooftop. Just a dollar for the yen? What? Why'd you do such thing? Yeah. It's Wednesday night. General weekly struck fest. And the bad part is none of these kills I'm getting on this gun are counting. Because, uh... Because, um, server's down. Fuck! Wanted the knife on him. Didn't happen. Oh. 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 Oh, you guys in chat. Oh shit. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, unlucky! Oh wow. Step right into that. Unlucky. Damn, dude. Damn, son. Ah, one of that. Crunch boy. Oh. Maybe. One upstairs. One upstairs. The salt handle it.
I'm not gonna get rezzed by this guy. Watch anime? Hell no. I'm not gonna get rezzed. Fuck, man, are you kidding? Rez. Wait. Oh shit, there's a lot of guys. Producing capabilities. Yeah, well, that's the thing. Axis forces lost because once the United States entered, like the Allies' industrial power pretty much doubled overnight. Just chilling. Okay. Am I stuck? Game, please. Oh, there's a tank here. Okay. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that. Fuck that. Oh, nobody's going to spot this guy. Why would you give up, nerd? Hmm. I have my nade back. No, I do. There we go. Three nades were dead to that. Watch. Ah! Maybe not. Okay. Nope! No, sir, to that. Yo, push it with the tank, mate. What's this guy doing? Alright, 91 health on this tank. Future for augmented reality should be good. Full server, okay. It's a little slow. Nope. Two up the hill. Oh, you got another one? Nice, dude. Oh my god. Then let's just go wide. Above here. I really. Oh god. Suppression on that. Awful. That's okay. Yeah, see, so he just flat out misses. Next to you. Oh! What's up, man? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. Okay. We'll need you all, motherfuckers. I get sniped by that. Oh, that's a plane. You're not fucking want. Oh my god. Tank in the capture zone? No, it's not. Oh, that is a lot of dudes. Oh, we're dead. We're dead. Yep. Thank you. Oh, unlucky. Unlucky. Can't do much about that anyway. I got you. Didn't get louder for you. 
Uh, I actually run the uh, minion PC for compression anyway, so it really shouldn't get louder. Not by any noticeable amount. Sweden sucks, Norwegian. Someone left. The vehicle went for G. Armored car. Oh, that's a heavy tank that way. Nope. Not going that way, nerds. I don't know if I should. Climb this? Yeah, we can. Sweet. Can I climb this all the way? Stuck! No! Why, game? Oh, that's a lot of recons. No. That's the train. We're dead. Oh, we're dead. <laughs> train, heavy tank. Yeah. We're not gonna get res there. Not that we'd want one anyway. Some Carly Ray Jepsen. Yeah, so you think Carly Ray Jepsen is pretty young, but I think she's in her thirties. You gotta trust Fetch and kill him. Yes, he did. Nice. Of course, I get killed by that, even though that was kind of nowhere near me. Good job, game. Nice. Love you, game. Oh, the train. Of course I'm right, I'm always right, motherfucker. How do you guys even doubt me? More some edgy bot commands? Might be able to type exclamation commands. Well, there's one for Fedge. I know there's one for Kia. There's one for Hexbred. Oh yeah, there's that one. There's Butt Hurt. Butt Hurt's a good one. You might want to hit that one. I know we have an Ivanka command. We have a Tiffany Trump command. Fuck, why am I getting stuck on things? Dice, please, fix your old game. That's not happening. Alright, let's worm it. Nope, oh, nope, we're not even in the capture zone yet. It's not smart. Let's not do that then. Okay, well, what was still damaging me through the door there? Nice. It's your game. Your game. Please. I got him. And we've got a lot of fun commands in here. Oh, shit. Oh fuck, no that's the arty truck. I would have died if I stood there. Yeah, we need to get the fuck out of there. Nope, the fuck out. Come on. Come on. Nade spawn, come on. There it is. Oh fuck, nope. You suck.
Huh? Uh oh. Doesn't bother me. That okay. Help me. Help me, team. Damn it. Can't even steal these kills. Such an unlucky night. Awful. Or just grazing that full burn. The oh, fuck just hit me. Guess the uh, AT rocket, I guess. Light tank error by my side. Like no health. Where is there? Fuck. Well, at least we got ammo back. White Christian atheist. What? What? Train get elevated. What the fuck, train? Fuck you, train. Seriously, remove the fucking 3D spotting from infant from fucking um armor. How you fix this shit so they don't feel like they can just sit there and take pot shots. Well, they can if they want, but they're going to have to actually guess. I'm just shooting at Doritos. Like in Ravik's video. I don't know if I should get this guy. No, it's not good. He's half dead. Order waiting to happen here. That would be bad. Okay. So. Oh my god, I stepped in that. Fuck. Ugh. Awful. Wu Tang. Tang's good. Plus, the kids are probably too young for that Wu Tang. No. Oh. Go straight ahead. Got him. Holy shit, nope. Come on, you can get the other guy. Oh, fuck me. Holy shit, what is going on here? Oh my god. Alley oop. Yes! Ah. Uh, get fucked. Get fucked. Oh. Alright, you got him. Alright, hold on. All right, we need to open up another folder. Here we go. There we go. Skeletons having a sword fight? You what? Oh, fuck you, train! This is garbage. No, please don't. Oh, please don't. Alright, we're going for Echo. Okay. We're going for Echo, I promise. Oh shit, here he comes, here he comes. <laughs> Peace, what's up? I think someone cure death. I don't know. Oh, 
None of these kills are going to count, though. Oh, that sucks. Kind of sucks. Because I really, um... I, I should probably have enough for, um, 100 kills for this now. But the problem is that... Oh. Please, no mortar. Oh, fuck. He... That guy's kind of... Thrown in on me. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, light tank, okay. Okay. You can see nose jack shit. Oh. There's a light tank there too. Of course. That's really annoying. You don't even see the fucking um thing firing. You just die. Great game, dice. Great fucking game. Great fucking game. Guys, four service stars with the fucking train. Must lose a lot. We'll heavy tank on Charlie, of course. Well, they got the. Uh, Fuck, we're dead. Come from. I hear him. That's stupid. Fuck you, dice. Fuck you, dice. That is so stupid. I'll need to make it so once you vault something, you can't fire. You have to pull your gun back out. Because by the time I see that animation, he's actually on the ground. Really annoying. Heavy car on Charlie. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, the World Cup match was great. Still got their shit kicked in. Fuck! Okay, that's dumb too. You see that? Instant spin around lock on knife. So dumb. Ugh, fix your shit, dice. Eh, yeah, there's a lot of annoyances in this fucking game. A lot of real annoyances. Okay, none of this shit matters anyway because the server's busted. Yeah, this shit doesn't matter.
battle packs expire in 18... Oh, new battle packs in 18 minutes? Sweet. Okay. Let's see. Nice. Yeah, I have 298, 298 XP boosts, I never use them. Need one more piece for the bill hook. Yep. I pretty much all the skins have been battle packs. You also have multiples of all of them. It's kinda cool. All remixes of mainstream music. Yep, for the most part. Why? What's up, Olarcon? Yeah, none of this shit is counting right now, so I don't even know why I'm using the shit weapons right now. These aren't counting towards the, uh, thingy. Ugh. Alright, let's go 1895 NP. How many kills do I even have with this? Need to pick up 17, okay. Thank Hunter Delta. <laughs> oh, that wasn't reloaded. Fuck. Oh, that's. Oh my god, that was a fail on that. Oh shit. What's up, man? What? Okay, that was weird. Swarm those right on him. Later, socks. Have a good one, dude. Oh, makes sense why we haven't pushed around that corner then. Oh, watch the plane. Best game ever. I don't 
gonna push this. I want my nade back already. Ah, yes. Been to Abu Dhabi. Well, this, an, this is an infantry variant, right? But you have to come to a complete stop for about a second before you get perfect accuracy out of it. It's kind of silly. Like, at that point in time, I might as well just use a scope. Nick, what's up, man? But yeah, kids cry even when the stat servers are down, so it's like... No. Who gives a shit? I don't know. Kids find something to whine about all the fucking time. These games. Five dollars worth some tiny emotes. Yeah, I have to apply for partnership in order to get emotes. And that's not high on my list priorities, because I don't need... Two dollars a month from kids on Twitch. Oh my god. Did not see that there. Lame. Okay. Not gonna get roused either. Oh. Three medics. Bomb of scoreboard. Makes sense. Oh, DJ Khaled. That guy apparently had some really cool Snapchat or whatever. Dia used to link it all the time. I don't know how I suppressed that guy, Rav. I got points for it. Every tank behind us. Yep, knew that was coming. Compare on Hitler. I know it's kind of funny. You know what that's called? That's called Godwin's Law. Godwin's Law says the longer a uh, discussion goes on, the higher chance there is of somebody to try to equate something to Hitler or the Nazis. It happens without fail. Not the right way to go. Yep. Now it's gonna get really boring. Actually, I'm gonna bust out the label. Yeah, this looks like we're gonna have to get a label sniper. Ah, I got the. Hey. What? Oh my god. What the fuck is wrong with me? Killer didn't use chemical weapons, though. I cannot hit a fucking thing right now. 
I don't know the lead on this gun. Damn it. The thing is, Zyklon B in an artillery shell wouldn't actually work well. Because you need continued exposure to it for it to work. So, yeah, it's kind of why probably didn't come up with any sort of artillery shells to contain it. Yeah. What the fuck is wrong with me? What the fuck? Okay, there we go. People could be offended. Yeah, definitely don't want to offend anyone. Suppressed anyway, too. Based on where we're standing. Hey, what's that? Do that. It's starting to drag my scope over to the side, too. Be awful. Pressure needs to go. Nice. <sighs> the suppression. Can't take shit without offending anyone. Oh my god. God damn it. I think it might be high. 85 plus no. Oh man. Yeah, it's been a strug night. Oh, I get fucked, gay boy. seeing a scope through that. It was well made game guys. Very well made game. Suppressed. <laughs> so awful. Sniping at oh. Yeah. Just got her shotgunned. I'm sure that guy's happy about that. I'm out to our lit tonight, I don't know. Chat's been lit all night. We haven't gotten any butt hurt kids yet though. I'm actually surprised by that. What the fuck? Nice. Oh my god. Yeah. It's been a struggle night for me. Whatever. EF1 EF Uno 
You got him. But her kid, nice. Fuck, man. Damn Wednesdays, I know. Wouldn't be surprised if Dice only restarts their servers every two weeks now. It's starting to seem like it. Look at that panic nade, what an asshole. Fuck you and your panic nade. Posting shape for chat. Second, um, this might be your connection, buddy. Not sure. Um, yeah, it's pretty standard thing. Streams are delayed. Welcome to Twitch. Sweet, the train. No, oh, we're gonna die of that. Nope. No. This guy is gonna blast me in his face. Actually, he might not have his gun anymore. That's the thing. Nope. Got that gun though. I'm Traveler. Possibly. Rowdy Ron 1. Wonder if he's rowdy. How rowdy is he? I get shot by that train. Just go away, train. But even this time. Uh, I don't know, man. You fucking want mates? Yeah, it's nice. Been pretty boring though. Pretty standard though. Battlefield one. Fuck. Shit. Where's the medkits? New medkits. Hi. Help me, team. No health. That's awful. Awful. I'm gonna get minioned. I can already tell. I'm gonna get minioned right here. Because I get minioned every fucking game. Pretty old. I think that guy got minions. Sweet. Fuck. Ugh. Lame. Too prone by my boy. Not scoring any fucking points tonight. Ugh. I'm killing well. That's okay. I think I got him both. Is there support in the medic? Yep. From 2004. Yeah, I think the song's pretty old. Fuck, might get minion. I'm stuck. Dice, what am I stuck on? Oh, 
Oh, screen shake. Gotta love it. Get stolen. That guy's probably not pleased. <laughs> Up three Adderall, take them. Okay. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Did not realize that was empty. We've ended poorly. No. Oh. Getting bombed or some shit right now. Charging shit with my uh, thingy. Oh, I shot him going over the top. Lame. Lame. Oh man. Only two and a half hours in the stream too. That sucks. Yeah, I've been ready to quit like an hour ago, probably. Well, like 90 minutes ago, I think. Ugh. Fuck. Let me stand up, please. Stuck. Dice. No air shotgun. No. Fuck. Push me right now, or I'm gonna get naded. It's a lot of guys. Yeah, it's definitely a lot of guys. Shit. Oh my god, holy fuck. What is going on? Oh. Oh my god. Yeah. My god. Uh, no. No. I'm gonna die again. Oh, here it comes. Nope. Not breathing can solve all your problems. What? Oh shit, why are my friends texting me at 3 o'clock in the fucking morning? Let's see, what is this group text? Hey, okay. strippers, alcohol. Makes sense. Okay, of course. And none of these stats count. I don't even know why I use the shit weapons tonight. Because any kills I got didn't count towards the uh, 100 for the... Uh, 
with the um, service star. It's time for last call. Yeah. Go sleep. I probably should. Pretty tired, but. Mm. I don't know, do I even want to play Zelda tomorrow? I don't even know. I get it, we're gonna go support. Stats not saving, I know. Not the stats I care about, it's the weapon kills. If I can get all the service stars done. Yeah, so it's like the stat server never goes down. During a round where we're losing. Oh. Only rounds where we win, so actually our win percentage should probably be higher. It actually is. That's okay. Is, could you help? No, Ron. I wanted you to uh, help flip us. No, we haven't converted our fucking bike. Play Zelda. Bomber. Taylor. Expensive wallets. I don't know. Guess possibly. Yeah, if we start base raving, these guys are gonna leave. Then this might be the last round of the night. Then. Why are you running away from the light tank? You are the fucking. God damn it! Ugh. Oh, yeah, that's my night in a nutshell right now. Duct tape wallet, that's kind of cool. I had one of those in high school back in the day. Go fuck with him. For him. Got limp it. All right, there we go. And limp didn't land on him. Is it dead? Nice. dead. Take the ammo. The golden ATMs. Yeah. Or how about Japan with their, um, fucking, um, used panty, um, vending machines or whatever. You know, some pretty weird shit around the world. Oh. Yeah, you're suppressed. Good luck shooting me, guy. Oh, back can my windmill. Watch your shotgun. Yeah, that was really weird shit. Got him. Heavy tank out spawn. Guy bayoneted me, right on me. <laughs> Someone just teabagging and bench stabbed him. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Oh my god, really? 
I did not expect two in there. Fuck me. Ugh. I go to sleep. Yeah. That would just be one guy. Yeah, this is why the bar is better than the Madsen. That first guy would have died. Badges people every now and then. Like every now and then, one will come into the Discord server and we'll just fucking rip him in half. 10 ATS, not sure. Probably just throw him away. Really don't need them. Sweet spot. Paper shipping? No. It's not even worth my time to send them to anyone. Kill him. Oh, nope, guess not. Alright, it's dead. Alright, sweet man on the rooftop. 3 12 in the morning. How are my eyes not dead? Why would you think they're not right now? The 360 has a footrest? Whatever, I can see it happening. And what's the use price on that? 50 bucks. Look at that, Baylor. Baylor windmill. I'll film smashing them up. No, because that would mean I would have to go set up a camera and all that shit. I'm just too lazy to do that. Two heavy tanks here. Or then no. No. Guess we'll just see. Whenever I decide to actually replace all the parts in it. Drop that ammunition. Ammunition for you. Baylor and FBNs. Supercar. Somehow I get the service star for this, but I don't think it actually counts. Yeah, come on. Let me see how many kills I had with the uh, Madsen Storm. All right, well, I was at 195 before this. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see if these actually, um, persist. 
I shouldn't play. Um, I don't know if you've noticed, but I haven't been playing well at all tonight. So, this is kind of just a chore right now. I've been staring at chat, mainly. You know how it goes. <laughs> yeah, so. Nah. Not too much has been going on. And why do I have this pistol equipped? But yeah, um, what was I saying? Um, yeah, I'm putting in, uh, two new Titan XPs, those new cards that got, uh, released last week that everyone on the internet is crying about that bought a 1080 Ti. Yeah, we're doing that. Holy shit, leave me alone! That's not the right way to go on that. Come on. Give it to me. No, it didn't happen. But fuck me. Ugh, FG, what's up, man? You argue it's worse? No. Every single metric has it above the 1080 Ti's right now. Even everyone that's uh, been benchmarking them individually. Oh, it is a pure upgrade compared to 1080 Ti. Yeah, my my water blocks uh, that I bought for the original Titan X Pascals fit the 1080 Ti and the new Titan X anyway. So, I I doubt um EK will even make Titan XP blocks. Please, limit charge kill. Come on. Nope. No, it's not. Uh, um, the core speed is increased, the RAM is increased, uh, more t uh, more TMUs, more CUDA. Yeah, it's better card. Which is why uh, kids are crying so hard uh, by the 10 ATI. Because they thought they'd be able to tell all their friends they had the best card on the market. That only lasted about a month. And arguably the uh, Titan X Pascal was still better than the 10 ATI anyway. Don't sleep. Nice. Yeah, there's a new, new, new. If not, I would have uh, done the 1080 Ti's like last weekend, that install. But no. They announced that Friday, the Titan XP's. Yeah. yeah. The 1080 Ti is still a great card. Which is why I think it's funny that uh, people are upset about it. <laughs> See if that kills them. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Console. That brain is about to explode. Whatever. All your friends are on console? Stick with console. Don't be like one of those weirdos who uh, bought a PC just to stalk us on the servers. Yes, there are a few viewers who have done that shit. <laughs> no legit hero. Yeah. But, um, yeah, don't be those, don't be that guy. Seriously, don't be that guy, just play where your friends are. Nope. Oh, that was nearly not good. Okay, they're over here. I cannot aim right now. This is awful. You'd used to find us all the time. Yeah, that's that's a weird in and of itself too. But uh, well, I mean, it's like some of you have like abandoned your console friends just to build a gaming PC just to nut hug. 
the light. That's just fucking awful and weird. Just don't do that. Don't be that guy. Yeah, mouse and keyboard is better once you get used to it. Oh, uh, I'm so tired. Probably going to be the last round since we're at the three hour mark. No, nope, leave me alone. We have lost a I'd base. get killed by this. I'd get killed by Mr. Artie Truck, watch. That's him. Have a charge kill, please. Please, game, I beg you. Let me have it. Oh, sweet spot. Oh. Friend like that. It's PS4 when No Man's Sky came out. Yeah. 120, 144 is noticeable. Uh, you kind of have to be looking for it while you're playing. You don't think you can adapt? Uh, I don't know. Take you a few months. A lot of people don't have the um. The oh, fuck! Oh my god! Come on! Why did I get the front knife on that? That's awful. Go away, plane. A lot of people are way too prideful to try to switch. Or what they'll do is they'll, uh, play... He's dead. Or they'll, uh, try to play with console. On PC instead. But yeah, that's not gonna work, guy. What is this fucking dude? Actually, a lot of guys here still. Okay. Actually, wait, that's probably the blimp that's capping. Yeah, it is. Okay. God damn it. Oh, you see that that suppression pulled that bullet into me there. Yeah. That guy was nowhere near me. I mean, just RNG. RNG headshot in me with that. Dark Souls cumbersome mouse and keyboard. Well, some games are better for controller. Anything that needs a constant input direction? God damn it. You don't think you should be able to lock on melee from the front? You shouldn't be able to lock on ever. This game has so many fucking problems with it. A lot of broken shit in this game. I'm convinced this is first battlefield for a lot of the shitters that are still left playing this, so. so yeah. So they don't know exactly what's broken yet, or they know there's something wrong with their with the game, but they can't put their finger on it yet. They don't know how to uh, lo vocalize their thoughts. Fuck, I can't even talk right now. Fuck me. Oh, that's the bomber. No. Nope. Oh, that's a tag plane. Okay. Oh, what's the bomber? Okay. Fuck, dude. Can't see where he went. There we go. Oh, that's a heavy tank over there. My eyes are so dry right now. I don't even know what's going on. That's what's that. Okay. Yeah. Scorpio, cool. Yeah, Scorpio should be good.
<laughs> Alright, how did he not shoot him when he was AFK? It's awful. <laughs> See, you always have to BM. That's how you uh, entertain yourself with this game now. This is awful. Why would he get off that? Why, man? Damn it. I would have destroyed it if you uh, was still on it. 50k for AK camera? Nice. Oh yeah, the red camera. Fortunately, you can't really find anything to watch that back natively on. I hear still. Dead. Okay. I'm so tired. I don't even know what's going on right now. In the chair face cam. Yeah, I should do that. Comes. I'm stuck. Why? Iraq has weapons of mass destruction. Well, did you know WMD was actually found in Iraq? know who has them now little group called Isis and before you call fake news on that New York Times actually reported on that only thing Iraq did not have was a weapons program but they still had a shitload of leftover artillery shells what's interesting is um Bush administration knew that but they didn't want to widely report it because at the time Isis wasn't that strong So, um, didn't want to report on it because then it would just encourage um, some of those groups to try finding those weapons. Yeah, seriously. Search New York Times, WMD, Iraq. Hands on the definition of WMD. Well, what is a WMD? Weapon of mass destruction, so classified as either a chemical weapon, biological weapon, or nuclear weapon, or even a radiological weapon. Scorpio will or free sink. Cool. So tired. Fuck me. Why am I on fire? Nice. This is awful. Pretty well known fact that. A lot of Del YMD was actually found in Iraq. Right. Weapons program? No. But did Saddam's people still have that shit stockpiled? Yes, they did. You're gay because you play on console? Cool, man. I own multiple consoles, so I guess that makes me a triple gay? Please, no. Oh man. Yeah, I've had some really awful rounds tonight. Saren, yep. He's on Xbox, nice. Yep, none of this shit counts. 
So I actually wonder if I use the Madsen again. I still think I had 195 kills. Still pop the uh, thing up. Oh, Suez. Actually, never mind. I guess we're done, boys. Alright, guys. It's been fun. We'll be back. Either Friday at 27 inch for 1440p nooch. 4K, you probably want a 30 inch monitor for that. But anyway, guys, yeah, it's been fun. I will see you guys on. Actually, uh. Fucking, uh. See you guys on Friday or. See you guys on. Yeah, where's the storm? See you guys tomorrow. Yeah, see? None of that shit counted. Yep, all night. None of the shit counted, so it's okay, guys. So, win rate should be higher. But yeah, guys, have a good time. Have a good rest of the week. Do well in school. Kiss your mom. All that sort of shit. Thank you for following, by the way. I got see you guys Friday for BF1 or tomorrow for Zelda. Peace out.